Ship Vlog, Stardate 9901.3. Captain Gregory is presently en route to Starbase 211 via shuttlecraft, having been recently recalled there. We've received an emergency communication from the Federation Merchant Marines. A number of cargo ships, operated by an Andorian shipping company, have gone missing from this side of the Klingon border, near the planet Taladar. We have been ordered to investigate these disappearances. Arriving at Talonar, Commander. Full standards. I'm detecting a small debris field of 1.5 million kilometers. Red alert. Shields at maximum. Helm, take us in. Aye, sir. Scan for enemy vessels. None of the immediate vicinity, Commander. Life signs? I'm reading two Andorian life forms for the wreckage. Helm, take us into closer scanning range. Aye, sir. Tactical? Stay on the lookout for Klingon vessels that may be close. Transporter room. As soon as the shields are down, beam the two survivors aboard. Transporter lock established, sir. Science, can you identify the wreckage? Yes, sir, it's the Shellera. It's an Andorian ore miner. Shields down. Commander, two Klingon ships just cloaked on the far side of the planet. They'll be in firing range within 30 seconds. As soon as the transport is complete, Raise shields. We're here to conduct a rescue operation and an investigation, not to start a war with the Klingons. Still, keep phasers and torpedoes on standby. Open hailing frequencies with the Klingon ships. Aye, sir. Attention, Klingon vessels. This is Commander Mooney of the Starship Potemkin. He's currently engaged in a rescue operation. Message from the Klingon commander, sir. On screen. I am curious as to why the Andorian ship you are rescuing came into our territory and fired upon our vessel without provocation. This is unaligned space, Commander. Besides, you know how civilians are. That ship opened fire on this bird of prey, and we were forced to defend ourselves. Regrettably, we did not have the chance to ask them what they were doing here. And I warn you, if your vessel comes any closer to our positions, we will not hesitate to open fire on you as well. You're warning me? You'll find that a uprated Constitution-class starship packs a little more firepower than a Class Four defensive phaser on a civilian yacht. Commander. Secure from red alert. Maintain the shields in case the Klingons change their mind. Sick bay. How are the patients doing? One of the injured appears to be beyond our medical abilities, but Dr. Drake isn't giving up on her yet. The other Andorian had only minor bumps, bruises, and a dislocated antenna. Mr. Fraser, bring them to the captain's ready room. Yes, Commander. Our guest, Commander. Okay, let's have it. In two sentences or less. Using a new experimental sensor platform, we discovered a massive vein of dilithium ore on the planet. When the Klingon ships decloaked, our pilot panicked and fired our defensive weapons. Are the Klingons aware of the sensor technology? And have they discovered the dilithium yet? I do not know, Commander. We had no way to observe them once they attacked us. We were only trying to survive. They have had nearly two days to scan the planet, but I do not think their own sensors could detect it. They may have already discovered the platform and put it to use. Mr. Avery, I need you to prepare a boarding party for the Andorian ship and see if that sensor platform is still aboard. If it is, I want it beamed up to the Potemkin, if possible. If not, I want you to place charges around it, and we will destroy it. Hi, right, sir. I will go with you and show you where the operations console is. We may be able to salvage it, if not the platform itself. At least the Klingons did not get a chance to use this device to try and scan the planet below. There's no way they won't find the dilithium. How do we keep them away? 
Klingons are stupid. They fear nothing. You heard him. Good to hear from you, Captain. We'll rendezvous with you in Sector 46A in three hours. Everything okay there, Dutch? Fine, sir. Klingons had a little run-in with tourists. We were rescuing some Andorians and we were trying to salvage their yacht. They got stranded by the planet Kalinar, which as you recall, is infested with tribbles. I think they were trying to smuggle a payload of them back into Federation space. Anyway, we'll finish mopping up this mess shortly. Understood, Dutch. Glad to hear it. Let me know if you need anything. Shuttlecraft Eisenstein, out. Jeez, I wonder, was it something I said? Alright everybody, let's clean up this situation. Engineering, we need three recovery teams in the shuttle bay in 30 minutes. <laughs>